What is up guys, Shortstack here, and welcome to Bad Parenting Part 1, Mr. Redface. This is a game that Axis recommended me. I've seen a couple TikToks about people's reaction to it. Like, just face cam files, no actual gameplay. But as far as this game goes, I have no idea what to expect. And, uh, yeah, I mean, there's not much more to say. Let's get into it. This goes hard. Oh. Come back to old God. Screw you. Son, mom, you're home late again. Oh, that's who's saying it. My bad. Come on, I was busy with work. Can you have some sympathy for me? But today is my birthday. Oh, oh, of course, I know that. Then where's my gift? Um, have you ever heard of Mr. Redface? On the birthday of good children, Mr. Redface secretly leaves gifts while they're asleep. Really? Of course. If you want to get your gift, you have to go to bed right away. I'm going to bed right now, Mom. Oh. Hi. You're fooling the kid again. How many times have you come home this way? <laughs> I was working and my shift ended late. I hate these character models. Oh, hi. BS. You think I... You think you... Oh my god. <laughs> you still think I'm an idiot, don't you? Oh, screw! That should not have scared me. <laughs> I didn't expect him to move. Hey, you, get back to your room. <laughs> Man, this, yeah, this really is bad parenting. Don't stand here eavesdropping on grown-up conversations. Okay. Um. Oh! Uh, alright. Can I sprint? Ooh, I sure can. Alright, well, let's go to our room like dad, dear old dad told us to do. Which one? Is this my room? This is definitely not my room. The small house that we live in here. Oh. Okay. Sleepy time. Boom, boom, boom. It's a sleepy time. <clears throat> He's in my closet. He's in my closet. Bro. Um, Mr. Face. A dolly. Is that the gift from Mr. Redface? No way. Oh, okay, I thought something popped up in the bottom of my screen. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ron. Why is the doll talking? <laughs> what? You can talk? Of course, because I was created by magic. You even have the same name and appearance as me. That's right, my master made me just for you. Okay, so our name's Ron. 
but your neck seems a bit loose. Is this like a voodoo doll? It's okay, sometimes my master makes mistakes. This is just a small flaw compared to the other dolls. What's important is that from now on, I'll be your best friend. You know, I watched Child's Play for the first time the other day. I do not trust dolls at all now, so that's fun. That sounds wonderful. Do you want to play something with me? I'm good. Hmm, my master stored my toys in the closet. <laughs> Can you get them for me? Uh, yeah, sure, buddy. The closet is still stuck. Can you try that again? I've tried my best. I can't open it. Do you want me to do something else? I'm hungry. You're a doll. Can you even eat? No, you'll be the one eating, but I'll be able to feel everything you eat. My master linked all your senses and emotions to me so I can easily understand you. Wow, that's amazing. Sure is, almost like it shouldn't be possible. Um, yeah, I hate that. Oh, forgot that the doors close automatically. Mommy! Mommy, look what I got! I got this cool doll. His name's Ron, just like me. You're reading this letter at 1 p.m., aren't you, Sleepy Ed? Okay. I've prepared your favorite dish in the fridge, so remember to heat it up before eating. Lately, I've noticed you've been getting lazy about eating. You know I don't have much time at home, so please learn to take care of yourself and stop making me worry. One more thing. Don't forget to take your medicine after eating, Mom. Okay. So... This is just like fears to fathom then. <laughs> You're holding some else. Okay, well, how do I drop him? Oh! He stands. All right. You better not move. I swear. All right. Well, thanks for just appearing in my hand. Uh, oh, is that a bottle of wine? Tasty. Oh, medicine. Is that your favorite dish? Do you want to see me perform some magic? Not really. Yes, please. All right, I'll make this plate of food never run out. Okay. Every time you finish eating, the dish will be restored to its original state. That's pretty cool. Wow, that's amazing. What else can you do? Um. Excuse. <laughs> what? <laughs> Am I gonna get drunk from this doll? Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> you suck! What, what just happened? I don't know, you guess. Oh no, the bottle! My dad's gonna whip my booty. I hope he's still asleep. Your dad? Don't worry, my master has taken your dad away. Has he now? What did you say? Thank God there's nobody home right now. <laughs> oh, you teleported. Where's my dad? As I said, my master is taking your dad away. Why? Because your dad is a bad person. He often hits and yells at you. 
parents like that are taken away by my master to protect children like you. But this is too much. My dad doesn't deserve that. He's a bad person. No, he's not. Please, let my dad go, I'm begging. Alright, alright, but my master won't like this. It's quite a long way to where your dad is being held. You'll have to use a shortcut if you want to get there in time to save him. Show me the way. The shortcut is through your closet. Oh, I don't want to go in there with Miss Dreddy Poo. I don't want to go in there. From the, oh, hey. From that little jump scare at the kitchen table, dude. You still can't open it? That's disappointing. I guess we'll have to use your parents' closet then. If I, don't, I, I don't think I want to. I think we could just let dad go. You should know that these closets can function as portals. They can take you anywhere you want, including where your dad is being held. Give it a try. Oh. There's nothing in here. Oh right, I forgot. There are a few steps you need to take to activate this shortcut. Bring your dad's radio and place it in front of the closet. Okay, dad's radio. The radio will work like an elevator button. You need to select a frequency first. If you choose the right frequency, the door will open to the place you need to go. Seem, seems like that's not it. Let's try again. Hi! Ooh, don't like that audio. I think this is the one. Go ahead and step in. I'll stay here and watch the house. Uh, little doll, I... Oh. <laughs> well, if this doesn't look seancy. Hello. You look cool. You look like an old Animal Crossing character. What's up? I'm looking for my dad. Describe. My dad's name is Bruce. Such a... I'm not going to say that joke. Wait a moment. There are many Bruces here. Any more details? Is this Bruce a good Bruce or a bad Bruce? Well, my dad is the kind of person who gets a bit angry. So he's a bad Bruce. Let me see. There are still many bad Bruces. More specifics, please. What else does he do? <laughs> he often yells. Oh, like me! Still not enough information. Sometimes he hits me. And slaps too. And? That's all. The door is behind you. Shh. I suppose it is! Oh. Hi. Boo. Ha. <laughs> he just got startled. No, I didn't. Who are you guys? Just like you, we're kids on our way to find our parents. Is this what I look like? God! Uh, we're staying here for a bit. Do you want to join us? Uh, no. I'm sorry. I'm in a hurry. Okay, see you later. Thanks, guys. Oh, we've entered the PNG dimension! Hi, Dad. Dad. Please stop punishing me. It's me, Dad. Please stop punishing me. Uh, okay. What has he done to you? 
Come on, let's go home, or Mr. Redface will take both of us. Please, stop punishing me. Alright then. Spell. Hey, what's wrong with you? Why are you hiding in the closet? Mr. Redface has taken Dad. Oh. Well, that's a good thing, then. I'm not joking. It's a long story. Let me explain. How is your doll, Ron, doing today? Is it alright? The doll, Mom, how do you know about it? Of course I know, since you haven't taken your medicine today. Oh, that's right! This isn't the first time you've had such hallucinations. Every time you tell a different story, but the common factor is always that stupid doll. Don't you remember the previous times? No. <laughs> I don't know what is wrong with you. Just go to bed, it's midnight already. Alright. Um... Excuse me? <laughs> ah! Oh my god! Can we stop with the smoke? God! <sighs> what just happened, son? I had a seizure. Are you alright? <sighs> this is a good game. This is a good game. Do you feel better now? Yeah, Mom. It's Mr. Redfit. It's all right. Tomorrow I'll take a day off to stay home and take care of you. Really? Promise me, Mom. I promise. Now go back to sleep. Yes, Mom. It's gonna be there. Mom? You've broken the promise again. Again? Should I take my medicine? Like mother said. Oh, he's back over here. <gasps> oh, I thought he looked different. He's been beaten up. <laughs> what happened to you? My master beat the <laughs> Poor doll. He wasn't happy about what happened yesterday. Aww. I'm sorry, this is my fault. By the way, have you seen my mom anywhere? My master has taken her away. Oh... Crap. What? It just happened. I'm sorry, I couldn't stop him. You should run away because he'll come back soon to take you too. No, I have to save my mom and my dad too. How? Don't you see what he did to me? <gasps> the mystical card! I found this at my dad's prison. I think it might help us defeat him. that That's the spell to defeat Mr. Redface. Come on, quickly, go into the closet to find where your mom is, where your mom is being held. Am I gonna get scum scared? Oh, right, we have to use my parents' closet. Forgot. I'm going in! I'm coming, mama! Oh. Thank <laughs> you. 
Quickly, throw the spell in here and take cover. What's gonna happen? Um... Guess I'm gonna just go back through the portal. Because it doesn't seem like I can do anything here. Oh, you're smoking now. What's happening to you? My master has been defeated. The magic he cast on me is also fading. Are you disappearing? Don't worry, this is what I wanted. You should go outside and see your parents. I have a very distinct feeling that they won't be there. And that it'll be Mr. Red himself. Hi! Hello, people. Dad! Mom! Y'all are free now! Oh! You've been having an affair, haven't you? Oh. I told you I was busy with work. Liar! You've neglected this family for another man. Aren't you ashamed to lie to your son? And what about you? Do you think you're better than me? You're just a home leeching off. You're just at home leeching off me all year round. What kind of father are you? No matter what I do, it's my business. I still bring money home to support my child. And if you still think I'm a can I say that? Yeah, why not? And if you still think I'm a whore, you're lowering yourself even below that. Ooh. Gubernatorial. One more word. Fine, you and I will get a divorce. One of us will have to move out of this house. If you're still here tomorrow, I'll take my son and leave. You stay right there. Papa. It's gonna happen again. Oh, it didn't. He's Mr. Redface. Did he just snap the kid's neck? Why don't I know anything about these? You've always known. Because I am the knowing part of you. You've tried to deny and reject these things and made up stories to make yourself feel better about you and your dad. And me, I have to find a way to lead you back to the reality. 
I've tried many times many ways to help you accept this truth as easily as possible. And every time I fail, guess what happens? Tick tock, boom, all the memories disappear, you once again wake up at the starting point, which is the night your dad murdered you. How long have I been dead? 14 days. It can't have been that long. What really happened to my parents? As for your dad, he's hiding in a cheap motel room. What about my mama? My treasured mama? God, he looks petrified. Go home with me, Dad. Yeah, that's, uh... That's all kinds of messed up. What about my mom? She still sees me, doesn't she? That's right, because she's only home late at night. But if it's daytime... She's gone. Son? Do you have any clues about your husband's hiding place? You just dropped something, ma'am. What is that? It's a motel card, but I'm not sure it's mine. Killer father arrested. Dang. Am I coming to- oh, why is he sitting in the fire? Howdy! <laughs> I guess I'm one- Wait! Were those kids all murdered? Um, so, that was a lot. That is a really, really messed up story. Bad parenting number two coming soon. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm gonna have to go off and think about that one because holy crap 
Uh, if you like this episode and you're enjoying Spooktober so far, leave a like on the video. Uh, be sure to subscribe if you're new. And um, let me know if you want to see Bad Parenting 2 when it comes out. But for now, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see all of you in the next video. Bye-bye.